Hi kids, it's Math Stervakis. I'm showing you a triple beam balance. A triple beam balance is used to measure the mass, or how much something weighs, in grams. Our triple B balance has three denominations. It goes by one hundreds, tens, and ones. Now let's put a box of tissues on our scale, our triple beam balance scale, and let's find out if it weighs more than 100 grams. It does. Let's find out if our box of tissues weighs more than 200 grams. Nope. That means our box of tissues is going to have a mass of 100 and something grams. Now kids, keep in mind, a paper clip has a mass of approximately one gram. One paper clip has a mass of one gram. So this box of tissues so far weighs over 100 grams. Let's move our tens. That's a little too much. Let's go to the 90. So it looks like a box of tissues so far is 190 grams. Let's move our ones over. And there we have it. This box of tissues has a mass of 193 grams, around 193 grams for a box of tissues. I have a math problem for you kids. Here's a pencil. Now let's put our scale back to zero. And let's find out how many grams a pencil weighs. What's the mass of a pencil in grams? Kids, what do you think? Take a guess. Make a prediction. How many grams do you think this pencil weighs? Or what's the mass of this pencil in grams? Let's find out. Kids, one pencil has a mass of five grams. One pencil has the mass of approximately five grams. I have a math problem for you. If one pencil has a mass of five grams, what would a 12 pack of pencils have a mass of? What would the mass of 12 pencils, not in the case or in the box, 12 pencils, what would the mass of 12 pencils be if one pencil has a mass of 5 grams, what would the total mass of 12 pencils be? Good luck, kids, and be aware, math is everywhere. Click pause and solve the problem. Click pause to look at the answer. Click pause to look at the answer. Be aware.